Hey, what's up people? It's your boy Junior and today we're going to be working on a new painting. I haven't worked on a painting in over... Wait, it's only been a month. But for me, a month is a long time. Today we're going to be working on something new. Something I don't even... I, I mean, I don't know. Just I'm just working on something new. I'm working on a new style. A style that's been really pushing my creativity to different levels. And I'm getting kind of frustrated with it. Let me show you how. Before we get started, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. What's up, people? So I haven't worked on a painting in a while, and I remembered I have this roll of canvas paper in my attic that I haven't used, and I've been saving for a rainy day. Not sure what that rainy day was, but I haven't, and I wanna go get it. So, I haven't been up there in uh, quite some time. <laughs> <laughs> there's no ghost up there. And now that I have my canvas, I'm gonna show you my design. This is what I am thinking about doing. Tell me what you think about it. Looks pretty cool, right? All right, I'm not gonna show you too much because I kinda wanna show you when it's complete. Let's go put this on my fence. This is my first time ever painting on my fence like this, so I'm gonna tape this bad boy, and then we're gonna get to work. So as of lately, I've been on a creative funk and it's been a little difficult for me to get back into that routine. And it happens from time to time. And as an artist, it gets extremely scary that it happens because you almost feel like you're falling out of your game. And um, I think all artists go through that. And, and you know, at the moment, we think that we're the only ones in the world with that problem or going through that same difficulty, but a lot of people are in the same boat. And we have to remember that. We have to remember to be a little patient with ourselves and a little gentle. You know, creativity is a muscle and you have to train it, but you also have to rest it. Because if you don't, you're just gonna drive yourself crazy. and. You know, it may seem like I can be happy in my videos and happy in, in life, and I am, don't get me wrong, I really am happy. But I go through like, you know, difficult moments in my life as well, and, and I am just getting over one mentally, where um, I'm trying to really just uh, find my focus again and, and produce the best things that I can possibly produce. So um, if you're in that same boat and you're like me, just be patient with yourself. Let your creativity flow, it's there. It's not going anywhere. Just don't stop and keep moving forward, you know? So, you got this. The same way I got this. So now that the painting is done, I'm gonna frame it. I have this frame that I bought from Michaels like years ago that I haven't used. So I was like, why not use it on this one? So what I'm gonna have to do is resize this piece of art. So because it's larger than the frame size, I'm gonna have to cut it to the frame size so that it can fit. And I've never done that with this type of canvas, so I'm gonna be learning something new today. And that's a wrap. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. If you're going through a creative drought, don't worry about it. It's okay. It happens to all artists. It happens to everyone. Anyone who's trying to create something out of their minds or 
something that's within, it's always going to be difficult to try to show the world exactly what we see. So sometimes it's just okay to take a step back and come back a day or even maybe two days later.